I just have to wonder that if my sister were available, would he be standing on her doorstep? What up, y'all? This your boy Ace here. Welcome to Afternoon's Delight. So, I apologize. Uh, been a weird week with the soap recast. Been a very weird week. I did put up about three videos on Monday. Kind of glad I did that now because it kind of set the tone for the rest of the week. But uh, basically what happened was I got really behind this week with a lot of stuff. Um, a lot of the content I've been, spoke, like, I've been like a day behind as of late. And I got to catch back up here. And I'll be able to catch back up because uh, usually Saturdays going into Sundays is kind of like a light workload for me. So I could catch catch back up then. Um, but yeah, it's like I've been telling you, it's going to be like this all fall, guys. It's going to be uh, where I'm going to be very busy at times and not able to post any soap cat recaps. But this week was a little bit different, though, because B&B was preempted, I believe, on Wednesday in my area. And then the trials were going on yesterday. So I wasn't at, but I probably wasn't going to be able to do any videos anyways because I've been behind really since Tuesday. So, I'm not even sure if I would have got a video up, but I promise to get a video up to you guys today. But, let's get in this because I don't want to keep talking. Let's talk about it. Carter and Katie. I'm doing this video specifically for Real Talk. Real Talk does not support these two at all because Real Talk wants Quinn and Carter to get back together. But, I, in my position, I'm kind of realistically moved. Look, I'm not going to sit up here and wait for something that might not happen. I, I'm just, I can't do it. Especially with Soaps, man. I, I got to move on. Like. Especially since I talk about them, I will go crazy if I try to focus in on Quinn and Carter the whole time. Um, <laughs> like, if they don't recast her or anything like that, I haven't heard any announcements of what they're going to do with this character. I got to move on. But I think they're supposed to get to uh, talking about um, Quinn on Monday uh, episode. I, I think they are. But we saw... So, let, let me talk about Bill and Katie first. So... Bill and Katie had, it looked like dinner together or something, because it had to be nighttime, man, because um, I don't think it was lunch, so I think it was dinner, but um, they were talking, and Bill really wanted Katie, but Katie shut him down, and I'm glad Katie did this, because if there's one thing that Katie cannot do, she cannot trust Bill, because of Brooke. If you are connected to Brooke as a guy, I cannot, I, I know if I was a woman, I would not, uh, I would not be able to trust Anybody who has a history with Brooke or is interested in Brooke. It's not happening. She seems to always ruin relationships. So I cannot do it. Katie was smart. I was really proud of Katie. She shut that down today. She said, look, she loves Bill, but uh -uh, as long as Brooke is a factor, she ain't going back to him. So uh, she went back to the office and she was kind of thinking about it at Forest of Creation Center. That's when Carter came in. And it was good to see because, like, look, man. I said this. I said this in a past video, before the Quinn and Carter thing, because Kobe laugh. My guy, Kobe laugh, was the one that came up with that suggestion of putting Quinn with Carter. I originally always wanted to see Quinn. I mean, uh, Carter with Katie first. Uh, actually, it started with Carter and Donna. And then when they kind of get it, got away from that, I started thinking about uh, Carter and Katie. And so I was always a shipper of Carter and Katie first before I was even a, a shipper of uh, Quinn and Carter. So for me, you know, the only thing is I know Katie isn't going to be on there every day because she's got a behind the scenes role with the show. And I'm like, man, it's just not going to happen. So I still kind of hope they kind of lean in this direction as I want Carter to kind of continue this interracial thing that he's been doing, that they've been doing with his character. Um... We need to see more interracial couples on on these soaps. So I kind of I, I lean heavy towards that. Um, then uh, you know Carter going back to any other Buckingham's or whatever. So um, I'm all for it with him and Katie. Plus I think they have really good chemistry too. So I'm all for it, man. I, 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 regardless if you don't like Carter and Katie, man, I, I'm all for it. I'm a, I'm a supporter of them. But go ahead and get this video a like, man. Hit the like button for me. Uh, share the video, subscribe to the channel, especially if you're new in the zoo. Any comments I got, definitely put them below. And if you want to donate to the channel, hit the super thanks button below. I much appreciate it. So, yeah, I, I, I ship these two. I want to see how the conversation goes. Um, like I said, if 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 Quinn is either dead or they're going to move on from her, hey, Carter's got to go to the next one. Now, I was feeling, I was also feeling 
uh, what's her name? Um, Denise Richards' character. I forgot that quick. Uh, damn, I forgot that damn quick, man. Denise Richards' character. What's her name again? Uh, Shauna. I was feeling Shauna in Carter, too. So, I wouldn't have minded seeing that. But it doesn't sound like she's coming back full time. I think she's just coming back as a guest star uh, in a guest role um, coming up. Because I heard she's supposed to be coming back, but not on a regular basis which sucks because they could have explored that with her and um carter but um man i hope they figure out something quick though man i need to see carter with somebody you know what i'm saying so let's see what they do man but thank you guys for watching after news delight